Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to learn how to add reports to the Role Center in Microsoft Dynamics AX. We will use Enterprise Port Portal and Role Center in Microsoft Dynamics AX to you uh, to uh, complete this task. Uh, the scenario behind this re uh, report is adding report to Role Center is let's say that uh, you have uh, accountant role, and uh, you have certain users, and you have uh, uh, written or or uh, you have created reports to uh, for, for the accountants and you want that uh, that report to be on their web page whenever they come and log in in enterprise portal or role center um, they will see that report right away so the, the uh, taking that scenario we're gonna go ahead and use Microsoft Dynamics AX client and go in system administration and go in role center and complete that task so here is my server and here's my Microsoft Dynamics AX client uh, in order to do that we need to click on user profile and select the role let's say that this is accountant role so I'm going to select that role you can uh, select multiple roles and add user to that role and uh, that user all the, any changes that you will apply on um, um, role center uh, on that particular web page will be shown to all the users so in order to add a report to this particular uh, role center we're going to go ahead and click view role center uh, to this particular um, role so we're going to go ahead and click view role center and keep using internet explorer i have a different security setup that's why it's asking me to the to enter the password credentials but you will have a different security setup for um for for your uh, in your organization so we're gonna in order to add the report we're gonna click on site action and add it page as soon as you will add a page it'll show you the different parts of the page uh, this is the part where you know the header is and this is the other part and then if you keep going scrolling down there are different parts middle column right column left column uh, and then the footer wherever you would like to add this particular report you need to click that and click on add a web web part so <clears throat> in in this uh, particular scenario we're going to add uh, a report that is on Microsoft Dynamics AX so we need to click on left pane up here Microsoft Dynamics AX if you don't see uh, quickly the in the web parts the report don't worry about it there is a little arrow um, the forward arrow or the next arrow you can click on that until you see a report there so up here is is report and this is the web part displays report uh, data from uh, SQL Server reporting services this is going to be SSRS report uh, we have already a report made um, created the report and we have deployed it to AOT and we're going to and also uh, deployed it to Microsoft uh, um, SQL Server reporting server so what we're going to do is we're going to use that um, and uh, put it up here so up here um, you can uh, add to web to the header or to the left column to the middle column to the right column uh, wherever you would like to uh, add that report we're gonna go ahead and do the left column and click on add up here uh, we're gonna click on right here <coughs> click on edit web page and if you notice here right here on the right side let me make it uh, full screen these are the reports I'm gonna move it see if I can move it these are the reports that uh, you can choose from this is report selection uh, we have already report made called customer uh, demo or something like that so we're gonna move our mouse up there and click on C and it'll take us to the C section so we're gonna go all the way to the customer C 
request demo report we're gonna click on that and right here are some uh, the designing uh, view of the report up here you wanted to show the report toolbars uh, on the, uh, the report toolbar size small none or uh, that would be that if if that particular role wanted to uh, user wanted to filter or um, wanted to do uh, something to the custom customization to that particular report he or she will be able to do that right here you can select the layout but I'm not going to uh, do that but I'm just going to show you that um, uh, these things are there for you to use you can make as pretty as you can so we're gonna go ahead and apply and okay alright the, the report is basically added and we're gonna go uh, stop editing and uh, once we do that uh, and next time we'll open this particular page uh, the um, report will write here uh, as you can see right now the cus demo underscore report this is just cus ds I do not have the data right now I do not I, I didn't really upload the uh, um, sample data that's why this report doesn't have any data however it's a complete report uh, it'll show if you in, in your organization you will have all the data and all the report will show and user will have an option to uh, download that report or to print that report or to uh, um, uh, export it in uh, Excel or PDF so uh, basically this is uh, it how you um, add the report to to the role center in Microsoft Dynamics AX and I hope it helps